Hi friends and welcome to Revforce. The 160cc commuter segment has a lot of bikes to choose from. I had already reviewed the Honda Hornet ABS and the Pulsar NS160. TVS was the first to introduce the 160cc segment in the Indian market with the Apache RTR160 and it was one of the best commuters and have a lot of fan base across the country. And today I am going to review the Apache RTR164 V. The Apache 164V's design takes inspiration from its sibling, the Apache 204V and it looks fantastic with its striking body graphics. It comes with red, blue and black color options out of which the red and black color variants look stunningly attractive. The bike has been launched in three variants, carburetor with front disc and rear drum brake, carburetor version with front and rear disc brakes and I am reviewing the carb variants today. It also comes with an FI variant which gets front and rear disc brakes as standard. But the Apache RTR 164B misses out on ABS which is available on the Honda Hornet and the Suzuki Jigsaw. The Apache RTR 164B is powered by a 159.7cc oil-cooled 4-stroke four 4-valve four engine which produces a maximum power output of 16.5 bhp at 8000 rpm and 14.8 Newton metrics of torque at 6500 rpm whereas the FI version produces 16.8 bhp at 8000 rpm. The power output is fantastic and the throttle response is impressive with a great amount of low end punch and mid range performance but there are certainly vibrations felt when riding between 4000 to 5000 rpm. The gear shifting is such a delight with the 5 speed gearbox which is smooth and I really love the performance of the Apache 164V. The bike is very light and the handlebars are placed right up there to offer fantastic maneuverability both in highway and city conditions. The twin barrel exhaust looks stylish and the exhaust note is phenomenal like all other Apache's TVS as produced. I have done a 0 to 100 speed test on the Apache 164V and let's watch it now. The fuel tank is sharp and looks aggressive with the race inspired design and graphics. It gets a fuel tank capacity of 12 liters and we could expect a fuel efficiency of 40 to 45 kmpl. The digital instrument cluster displays the odometer, tachometer, fuel gauge, trip meters, RPM limit indicator, top speed recorder and clock. But the Apache 164V misses out on gear position indicator which the Suzuki Jigsaw offers. The conventional telescopic front suspension along with the rear monoshock suspension offers good ride comfort to the rider and the pillion. The 164V gets 17 inch 90 by 90 front and 130 by 70 rear tubeless tires for the dual disc variant whereas the rear drum brake variant gets 110 by 80 rear section. The Remora tires from TVS offers great road grip and inspires a lot of confidence to the rider. However, TVS could have considered giving the same rear tire section for both the carb variants to offer equally good ride quality. The 270mm front pedal disc brake combined with the 200mm pedal rear disc brake offers good amount of stopping power. But the Apache 164V misses out on ABS which are being offered by the Suzuki Jigsaw and the Honda Hornet with a single channel ABS unit. The seat offers good ride comfort to the rider but it is uncomfortable when a pillion is on board as the seat is not broad enough. 
The 35 watt halogen headlamp is not powerful enough to provide good amount of reach and visibility. It would have been great if the bike had a more powerful headlamp or even a LED unit. The tail light gets LED treatment just like its sibling, the Apache 204V. The indicators look good and are not LED but the conventional ones. The rear view mirrors also offer better visibility of what's coming behind. The Apache 164V is one of the best 160cc commuters in the country with stunning design and body graphics. At a price point of 1 lakh 3000 rupees on road for the dual disc carb variant, the 164V offers fantastic performance with great low end and mid range performance along with a good top end. The bike offers great handling both in traffic and highway conditions. If there is a new version comes by next year, it would be great if the 164V gets dual channel ABS and a LED headlamp unit. With a lot of options like the Suzuki Jigsa, Honda Hornet, Pulsar NS160 and all other commuters in this segment, the Apache 164V offers great value for money performance and in fact, the TVS Apache 164V is the most powerful 160cc commuter. And this concludes my review. Please do subscribe to my channel and hit the like button. I'll see you guys in my next review. Until then, take care and ride safe.